welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brooklyn. I'm currently doing my Disney College program here in Walt Disney World. If you're interested in my role is children's activities in the Dakino Star region. But, sorry. A lot of people here today. We're in Epcot today. I'm kind of doing a see how many rides I can get in, even though I'm starting at like noon. So we're just gonna have a fun day. At one o'clock, I'm gonna try to get a Guardians thing. Like I'm already sweating. But it's gonna be a fun day. Let's see where our first ride's gonna be. So another thing I want to do today is kind of do things I usually don't do, which is probably gonna happen because the um, wait times are looking pretty high. But like I said last time I was here, all the wait times um, at Hollywood Studios and Magic Kingdom were literally half of what the posted wait time was. So it might not be that bad. I think I'm gonna go ahead and I usually head towards the seas and the land pavilion and everything. I think we're gonna go the opposite way and maybe try mission oh well maybe i'm not gonna do that no because then i would have had to gone around okay so y'all these walls i was like yeah i can just go around it no i can't you can't do that here there are walls in the way so yes we are going towards finding nemo usually that's my first ride but it's like 30 minutes right now not feeling that i'm just gonna go into the Aquarium. Whenever I was on the monorail coming over, you literally see the you could see the line was like out to here for Finding Nemo. But now it's not. And I know it's really cold in there and I'm really hot right now. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and go in the line, even though it's a 30 minute wait, just to get some AC and kind of get a game plan because I kind of did this last minute decision to come here and didn't really plan anything, which is odd for me, so I do not know what we're doing today. So we're just gonna go into Finding Nemo. Hmm. The line's like all the way out here though. Oh well, no, it's moving. We'll see, we'll see. But it looks cute. I am in the aquarium area. I don't think I'm gonna stay because it's really crowded in here. It's usually pretty empty, but I think it's because it's so hot outside. Um, but the wait time that I waited was 25 minutes for Nemo and Friends. Um, it was posted 30, so pretty much like the same. Um, I usually wouldn't wait that for that, but it was so hot outside and I just wanted the air conditioning. Um, I'm trying to think I want to do Turtle Talk. I'm not doing Turtle Talk with Crush yet. I think I might say that till the end of the day if I do it though. Um, yeah, I'm now going to go over to the Land Pavilion. I think the Land Pavilion. I've never watched like the little show that they have, like the little video. I think it's like a 10 minute video. I heard it's not very good, but I'm already out of breath just from walking up that hill. They need to add like those moving walkways on that, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and watch the next show because it starts in one minute. It says it's huge. It's like two stories. It's crazy. All right. I just watched Awesome Planet. It was cute. I it. it also reminded me of those like nature videos and like biome videos you have to watch in um, school. You know, it has just like literally bunch of b-roll of like different biomes and like have someone voicing over it was really cute liked it um i think i'm now gonna go test out the wait time for soren it says 45 minutes let me check what the line looks like and then we'll decide for sure and it's up to 60 and i can see the line already nope we're not doing that okay cool we're then gonna go back around and try out the living with the land all right so i was gonna ride when we land, but the wait said 15 minutes long, but we're literally like outside of the queue. Not worth it. Whew. So I walked back up the stairs. Now I'm gonna slowly walk over to Big Mint. Maybe find a water fountain to fill up my water bottle. Ride Big Mint, because I think it's a 15 minute wait. Or just walk around, honestly. You might do like the butterfly garden. We'll see. Alright, Figment's up to a 25 minute wait, so I guess we're doing the butterfly garden. It'll still be cute and fun. And then if Figment goes down, I'll ride it. I'm just gonna try to stay in this area though, because it is like where like the low wait times are, so we're gonna head into the butterfly garden. This is the first time I've actually seen a lot of the butterflies. Usually me and my mom come in the early spring and the butterflies haven't like come out of their cocoons yet. Like there are so many butterflies, they're just everywhere. Like look over here. Like 
I don't know if you can see them, but like there's just so many just chilling. Just, oh, beautiful. There's a duck family. Look how cute they are. Oh, I think Pooh is out. I heard someone say, oh, he is. He's catching butterflies. You can come and see him. I'll go say hi to him really quickly. I'll go say hello. Oh, he's dizzy because he was spinning around. So cute. All right, Figment says 25 minute wait, but it is not like outside of the building yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it so we can have an AC break. It literally feels so good in here. You can tell like how much I'm sweating. Like, oof, not attractive. It's my sunscreen like melting off. This is what the line looks like. We're right, like right by the entrance. But hey, this is inside in the AC. We'll see if it's 25 minutes or not. She got off the figment. It literally took like five minutes, not 25, so that's nice. Um, it looks like they have a lot of characters meeting right now. Um, Vanellope is here from Market Mouse. She's over there. Joy is right over here. Um, yeah, that's really cool. They have a lot of them out. I personally don't like love any of those characters, so I'm not gonna stop. The lines are honestly not that long, so I might stop by if they had a character that I liked. Or like I like them, I, but they're not like my diehard faves and I want to ride rides today. So let me check the wait times and see what our next thing is going to be. Oh, and I completely forgot to mention, I um, brought my pins to do a little pin training whenever we get into World Showcase. Um, so if you know, each pavilion has a pin board and there's usually a lot of unique pins over there. So I brought them there in my backpack. I just didn't want to wear them because they're kind of clanky, you know? Um, I have them on a lanyard. I think I have like seven of them on there that I'm wanting to trade off, so we'll see if we can find any good pins today. I'm also getting a little hungry. I need to sit down somewhere and figure out what I want to do for my first meal today. Alright, so I just ordered some food from Connections. I just got the pepperoni pizza. I thought my cast discount worked there, but I guess not. Um, I know my cast discount won't work at any of the food booths, I don't think, because it's a weekend. Which kind of stinks, I should have planned that better, but it's fine. Um, so, my um, window for picking up my food doesn't start till like 35. It's like 111 right now. So, I'm just going to leisurely walk over there. Maybe look at some things. Figure out what my next things are going to be today. Um, yeah. Alright, I got my pizza. And I got, um, I asked for a good head cups for water. She gave me a cup for water, so I was able to get some water and some ice at the fountain. Um, and then before I do it, I'll refill it and refill my actual water bottle as well. I'm going to eat this slowly. Um, it has a pretty bad right now, but rain is expected in the next 15 minutes, so I'm sure that'll make things go down. We'll just wait for the rain. Alright, I'm done eating. I'm back outside. I think I'm going to go over to Mission Space maybe and do the, the green level. I did not like the orange level. It's almost being sick, but I feel like if I do the green level, it should be fine. Um, it's starting to sprinkle just a little bit, not a lot, and the sun's still blaring, so we'll see what happens. So I almost just went over to test tracking on their single rider, but if it's about to storm, they're going to close it down because it's halfway outside, so I guess I'm not going to do that. We are going to go over to Mission Space. I think it's like a five minute wait for the green side. So, I mean, it shouldn't be that bad, right? Maybe it's like the less intense side, hopefully. All right, just did it. It was really less intense, um, kind of like not thrilling, but I didn't get sick, so that's good. Thing. Oh, my sister's calling me, let me answer her. All right, the phone hung up on us, so if she calls me back, I'll have to stop for a minute. But I'm gonna check wait times, kind of see what it's looking like. It's clear skies right now, but I'm getting a three mile away um, lightning, so that might be it for like Blizzard Beach, which is usually where it is, but I'm gonna figure out what I'm doing next. I'll let you know like usual. Um, it's been a pretty chill day. It's really, really hot though. Really hot. So not enjoying that, but enjoying my time. The test truck is currently down, it says. They're still running cars through, but I don't think they have people in them. Um, I'm gonna go to the Mexico Pavilion because the ride in there says it's only a 10 minute way. And no, I'm not gonna say the right name because my roommate let me know that I've been pronouncing it wrong. And that makes me really embarrassed and I don't wanna actually say anything offensive. So 
the ride at the Mexico Pavilion. Um, I think it translates to the three gentlemen, right? Um, yeah, that ride is the one I'm going on. Um, I, like I said, I can't pronounce it, so I'm not even gonna try. But yeah, it's a 10 minute wait, so hopefully it still is when I get there. Oh, clouds over there, they're moving in. That's what it looks like over there. That's our beautiful storm that's coming in. I knew it said lightning within three miles, but I couldn't see the clouds until just now. But test track is closed. We're heading over to the Mexico Pavilion. Yeah, this is a no. This right here is the line for the boat ride that's all the way over there. Crazy. Yeah. Definitely not waiting in that line. Something else to do. So far, Epcot is showing me that it's crowded and it's summer. That's fine. It's actually not as bad. The wait times are horrible. Love that. But you know, we can still have fun. We're gonna do some pin trading. So I'm passing the Norway Pavilion right now. I'm not sure if they have a pin board. We're gonna go ahead inside and check out and see if they do. And also it's 10 minutes. Do I do it? I think I might do it. You know what? We're gonna do it. And there I waited like 15 minutes. And I looked at the app again and they had changed it from a 10 minute wait to a 30 minute wait. And I looked around and like there were like a lot of little kids and I just didn't want to like be the person to like take up time from the little kids. So I just decided, you know what, it's fine. I can, I can go without me on it enough though for today. Um, so I just felt bad like making these little kids wait. Like there were four, um, a few groups right behind me that were like, you could tell the parents were like trying to have their kids be patient. And I was like, you know what, they can go. I can do it any other time. I live here. It's their special time here. So I'm now just gonna look around, try to find their pin board and see what kind of pins I can find. Pin board over here. So I'm gonna go see if there's anything more taking. I think the Japan Pavilion also has some pins. Let me see if I can find anything in here that I want to trade. Um, I'll just have to find it because I have no idea where it is. China, not Japan. Let's see if China has any pins. It's a lot of beautiful stuff. Look at the hair clips. It's $12.99. Really good though. They're so pretty. Okay, I don't need any more hair clips. I have so many hair clips. I have so many. I don't need more. Walk away, Brooklyn. Walk away. Okay, I'm gonna try to find the pin board. Any that I wanted here either. All of them kind of just look a little basic. I'm looking for some, you know, really interesting, unique ones. So let's mosey on over to the next pavilion, see if we can find one. If not, I might do the American Adventure, like the show. I haven't seen it yet. And I really want to, so I think the next one's at like 3.45 and, or 3.30 or something like that, and it's 2.45 now. So hopefully I'll be able to catch the next one. It's just meeting here. It's so sure what this area is. We'll see. It's very open, very pretty. Just stuff about the Shanghai Disney Resort. It's beautiful. Like they have like the costumes and like a bunch of like drawings. They have like a whole like video over there. They have the Fantasia Carousel. Like, this is so stinking cute. Here, one more look, they even have a Toy Story stuff. This is so cute. Yeah, I think it's the Shanghai Disney Resort. They just have like a bunch of stuff about it. Super cute, super cute. So this is the castle. So cool. Oh wow, it says the wish. The mosaic sample is a full scale portion of the mosaic that is displayed in Enchanted Storybook Castle. It depicts Rapunzel from Tangled and was created to help Imagineers choose the right color and shade of tile for the final mosaic. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It's really interesting. Hmm. I'm surprised, I did not know that was in there. Really cool, it has a bunch of like um, history about Shanghai, Disneyland and um, bunch of art like not artifacts like well I guess artifacts but they're not like we didn't dig them up like what do they call them In installations I guess you could say um, 
and all a lot of fun stuff. That was really cool. Did not know that. And I also didn't know that Mulan met in there. So the more you know, I'm gonna go ahead and head over to the next pavilion, which I don't even know what the next pavilion is, honestly. But we're gonna go to it and see if we can find any cool, um, you know, if I knew words today, that'd be great. Pins, see if we can find any cool pins. cute and I have a friend who's about to have a baby so I'm like do I get said baby a stuffed animal I might need to I might need to come back and grab one Mickey pretzel it's so cute how much is it mm, I don't know if it's that cute very cute though I got I traded out one that I really didn't like and I got this one isn't it so cute here let me there you go so cute. That pin. I'm so excited about it. You probably are like, what pin is he using? Oh, what is happening with my camera? I think I'm on like cinema mode. Let me check. Change it. Cinematic mode, which is cool, but like, I don't think, I don't think we're ready for that quite yet. Anyway, you just saw the pin I just found. You're probably like, who is that? What is that? So if you don't know, Duffy the Disney bear used to be like the bear that was Disney, but they like kind of like aren't doing him in the States anymore. However, in the overseas, um, in some of the overseas parks, he's still a really big deal. There's like a whole Duffy's and Friends area in one of the parks. I can't remember which one. Maybe Shanghai. But um, I just found one of his friends. I can't remember her name. Um, I'll like try to find it and then like record like what her name is and like put it right here for you guys. But, um, yeah, super excited with that one. Okay, I'm back home now and I looked it up. Her name is Sheila May or Shelly May. Either Sheila May or Shelly May, one of those. And she's like Duffy's friend or something like that. Leaving Germany after finding that super cool pin. I'm super excited. I really hope it's real. Even if it's not, I love it. But we're now going into the Italy pavilion. Um, also, whenever I trade, I realize that like half of my pins are missing. Maybe they're like the bottom of my bag somewhere, like they fell off, but I don't know. But I only have two pins left to trade today, so I'll have to be even more picky than I already am, which isn't very hard. They're all at this thing called like the Kid Cot Fun Spot, so I never see if there's anything. There's also a child there, so I probably won't film. I'll just film if I get anything. Pizza, like a Mickey Mouse pizza purse and pizza ears. How much, how much are these? <laughs> um, they are... You can find the price. I can't figure out how much they are, but they're very cute. There's also like a little, little slice of pizza. That's 40. I'm assuming these are... If I can find the price, that would be great. Hello? Yeah. Um, oh, I think I found the tag. Nope, there's nothing on the tag. Okay. No idea how much these are, but they're very cute. Very cute. Very cool. Nothing at that one. Um, I saw those cute pizza ears in the bag, though. Those were really cute. Can't wait for those to hopefully one day come to Cast Connections or the Character Warehouse so I can get them cheap. And I'll have to pay much for them because, you know, I'm cheap. I'm going to check and see if there's one at the American Pavilion. I'm honestly not sure. Um, if not, I'll just go ahead and go into the American Adventure. Oh, Pooh and Minnie are meeting back there. Oh, I don't feel like waiting in the heat, though. So I'm not going to wait. But hey, just so you know, they would do meet back there sometimes, apparently. Got some of the Voices of Liberty singing. Now I'm looking at all this artifacts before we go on in. Very cool. Very informative. I like how they have literally everything they want. That's where I was born. Mm -hmm. This is nice out. This is really pretty. We just watched the American Adventure. It's really good. There were a few times in there I was like getting a little tear. It's like you know like when I really like make music in the background, they like show old pictures in black and white and just like really hits and you're like, Ooh. I don't know why. I think I'm just a martial day, but okay, I see the next. I see the kid spot um, over here, so I'm going to go see if there's any friends I want. Then move on to the next <laughs> one. And I have a lightning lane this evening at eight. Not lightning lane. I am um, virtual queue at eight for. Uh, 
Guardians. I'm not sure if I'm going to say that later on, but if I do, I'll go right that. No pins that I want from the American Pavilion. America Pavilion, American Pavilion, I don't know. Anyway. Um, I don't know where the Japan pin board is. And there's a huge crowd because they have like the drummers out. So I think I'm going to go ahead and skip that pavilion and just go on to the next one. And I catch it the next time whenever I'm here. Just check the Morocco Pavilion shop. They did not have any that I liked. So we're going to... I'm moving. It is so hot. I really want a slushie or something. So maybe I'm going to try to find one. I don't really know why they have one. But maybe I can... But as I was passing the France Pavilion, I saw Belle walking out. So I gave her a wave. Looks like minis up here. There are so many characters out today. I'm not used to seeing this many. I'm currently trying to find somewhere to get water because it's hot and I'm out of water. And that's never a good combo, so I'm going to go try to find some water. I might, I think there's Joffrey's up here by the UK Pavilion, I think. I might grab something there. Oh my goodness, it's Mary Poppins. I've never seen her like in person before. Oh, it's so fun. All right, I got some water. Definitely was not feeling too great. I think I was getting a little too hot. I hadn't drank enough water today, so got it. I filled it up and I've already drank half of it, so feeling much better. Um, there's honestly not a lot more I want to do, and the lines are just getting longer, and it's getting really crowded. Um, I think I honestly might go ahead and go back to my apartment, just because it is Saturday. I have church tomorrow, I gotta get up early. So I'm gonna walk to the front of the park, make my final decision, and then let you guys know. I have made a last minute decision. It isn't a trip to Epcot without a chocolate cake from Troll and Trowel and Troll and Sword of Heart, where you say it. And I really want one, even though it's a Saturday and I don't get my cast member discount all weekend, we're still gonna go for it and get one because I really think the ice cream will be really nice right now because it's so hot and I just want something sweet. So I'm gonna do that really quick. All right, I got it. It's my favorite thing. I get it every time I come and it's just beautiful and I can't believe they don't have it year round and that kind of makes me sad but it's fine. But yeah, I'm going to eat it real quick and then I think I am going to go ahead and head out because it's just getting busier it seems and I'm kind of burnt out for the day. Alright, that was honestly really good. I'm feeling a little better. I think I'm going to stop by yeah, somewhere right. else but and maybe get another treat. Go ahead and try to guess what I'm going to get. If you watched any of my past videos, I think I've gotten it in the past like two or three videos. But it's really good and I love it. And it has ice cream involved or Dole Whip, one of the others. So try and guess what I'm getting. Alright, if you guess an orange fan to float, you are correct. Um, it just sounded really good. Alright, I'm going to head for the exit. I guess this is the end of the video. Um, Sorry, it was a little boring. Sorry. Um, but if you'd like to do it, really like and subscribe to my channel so you have to get on all the content that will be coming soon. I'll catch y'all in the next one.